AI, artificial intelligence. It's all around us. It surrounds us. It's deep inside us. <laughs> that doesn't sound right. Today we're gonna play with it. That's, oh, that's so much worse. I found this website called Hugging Face. <laughs> No comment about that. This website is filled with just a bunch of AI APIs and a lot of acronyms for some reason. Basically, you know all those websites where you put in text and then it finishes the rest of it for you or it generates an image based on what you type? It's basically that, but there's so much more here. Like, look at this. Every single one of these does something and it has something to do with AI. We're gonna be playing with them today and it's gonna be it's gonna be hilarious. And if it isn't, feel free to sue me. I don't know. So everyone's familiar with the Dolly API. Basically, you type in a prompt and then it generates an image. You've seen them all around on TikTok or the Yahoo's or the Twitters or whatever you people use. You type in something and you get something in return. So you type, oh, I don't know, a T-Rex eating another T-Rex and it'll draw it for you. Observe. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. There's your example. What is that? That's <laughs> oh, oh, these two are merging. That's that's not funny. That one's standing on a volcano. So yeah, this is basically what you get. We're not gonna be playing with this today. We're gonna be playing with everything else that's on this website. So let's start with uh, talking face generation with multi. Yeah, let's start with that one. This system generates a talking face video based on the input text. But what do I type? Um. Oh, I got it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, submit. I'm, I'm, I'm wondering what the toxicity for this sentence is. Oh boy. Apparently it's 23% as expected. Let's see the video. Um, ma'am, that's not, that's not where you sit on an air. All right, whatever. It's more than time. <laughs> the magic of AI. This Pokemon does not exist. Well, then why make the damn thing? This Pokemon does not exist. Type your trainer name. Oh boy, okay. Up uh, to cash register. <laughs> That's my name. Who's, Who's that, that Pokemon? Pokemon? Cash registers Balastana. Okay, what's the. I, I know nothing about Pokemon, so this is gonna go a lot over my head. So the resistance is negative 30. I don't know how you can have negative resistance, but okay. Through yoga training, it gained the physique, the physic power to predict its foe's next move. Uh, oh, psych. Psychic power to, to, to predict its vote. Okay, so this thing can read minds basically. Okay. Again, I don't know anything about Pokemon, so um Alright, we're gonna we're gonna move on, I guess. Composer. Trained on 15,000 songs, one AI model, infinite compositions. This sounds like an Apple commercial. The space contains a deep a, a deep neural network model that can compose music. Okay. So we got eight instruments. We got a piano, a cello, we got a guitar, we got a piano, we got a church, we got a drum, we got a cowboy hat, and we got Bob Marley. My favorite instrument. <laughs> Let's try piano, high intensity and high temper temperature compose. But let's hear this masterpiece. Ha it's it's reported that Hans Zimmer himself wrote this piece. Let's hear it. <laughs> I mean, I mean as I mean uh, I, uh, let's do rock and metal, my favorite elements. Let's try high density, high temperature. Very high, in fact. <laughs> Me messing around in garage band be like, is this copyrighted? Am I gonna get struck for this? Can I, can it legally be described as copyright if an AI created it? Let's, let's find out. This is what Google's for. Artificial intelligence is already being used to generate works in music, journalism, and gaming. These Works could in theory be deemed free of copyright because they're not created by a human author. Okay, portrait style transfer. I don't like the emoji that they used for that. Okay, drop an image containing a near frontal face. Okay, I need a picture of myself. Hold on, be right back. Oh, oh, right, I forgot. I'm not, not popular. <laughs> <laughs> Buy my merch. All right, let me find an actual picture of myself. All right, this is the picture we're gonna use. Just print screen this bad boy, bam, and we are off to the races. All right, detecting a line face. What? Did it just tilt the image? I. Okay, fine, fair enough. This is the button that does it all. Reconstruct. That's not me. You gotta believe me. That's not me. That is a demon from heaven right there. 
All right, I need another picture of myself. Be right back. Okay, there's the picture. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> wow, breaking the fourth wall, are we? Detecting the line face. All right, reconstruct this ma this masterpiece right here. <laughs> That's not. <gasps> All right, I got a couple critiques. One, those aren't my glasses. Two. Where are my headphones? And three, I seem to have magically swapped genders. I guess that, I, I guess that's normal. Never mind. The, the point is, that's not me. I would not be looking two directions at once, but hey, that's, th that's just my opinion. <laughs> oh, I could select the style. So I could cartoon, character, anime, arcane, comic, Pixar, and slam dunk. What is slam dunk? Uh, let's try comic. <laughs> apes? This one's just called apes. All right. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. We're gonna, we're gonna move on. Story and video generation. All right. All right. All right. I get you. Choose a genre. Superhero, action, drama, horror, thriller, and sci-fi. Uh, let's try superhero. What's my favorite superhero? Okay. Homelander picked up the gun and snapped it in half. Now I know for a fact he wouldn't actually do that. He would pick up the gun and proceed to murder everyone in a five mile radius, but this is just creative liberties. Okay. All right. That's my starting text. And we hit generate story, and I think it finishes finishes the story. All right, let's see. Homelander picked up the gun and snapped in half. She t she turned to walk through the deserted street. She followed the shadow of her car through the streets and through tall buildings. She followed the shadow of. Okay. Um. All right. It's not finished though. That's whatever. Generate images. Okay. All right. This is a. Uh... These are definitely images. Why is death in this one? <laughs> Interesting. All right, let's choose another genre. Let's try, let's try sci-fi. What's a sci-fi? Uh, all right, I got it. It was done. The rings of Saturn had vanished. I don't know how, but that's what we're going with. Generate story. Mamma mia. It was done. The rings of Saturn had vanished. The film looks as if Earth was in fact struck by a meteorite during a lunar eclipse and a lunar eclipse has come up. The moon is covered in debris. Ah! Let's try one more. Let's try a uh, drama. <laughs> okay, let's see. Jesse turned and saw Walter wearing Morbius merchandise. Jesse tries to protect Walter. That's it? That's all you can think of. Uh, that that's not good enough. Nope, nope. We're trying again. Jesse used Gus as a human shield. Let's uh, let's see where this goes. Jesse, Jeese, Jeese used Gus as a human shield. His wife used Gus to be his human shield, but he fell over himself. Gus, Gus went to college and got a job at an advertising agency. He's <laughs> okay. I, I can't wait to see the pictures. Let let's see this. <laughs> No, those aren't humans. Those are not humans. Those are those are aliens right there. What? Oh God. What? Uh, uh, that's Joe Biden. <laughs> Isn't that the dude from the Prager U commercials? <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, all right. That was um. That was interesting. Poster to plot. That sounds interesting. Uh, upload a movie TV poster to generate a plot. All right. Let's find a TV poster. <laughs> <laughs> All right, a group of friends are stalked by a serial killer. Yes, that is exactly what it is. The killer is determined to kill them all. The only way to stop him is to find the killer himself, but the killer is not what he appears to be. He is a ruthless killer. He wants to kill every, everyone in the world, but he is. <sighs> Damn, Squidward! <laughs> Unintentionally the most hilarious thing I have heard all day. Let's try again. All right, a group of young people are sent to a remote island in the Pacific to find the cure for a deadly disease. But when they discover that the island is inhabited by an evil cult, they begin to suspect that something is amiss. Oh, wow, there's an evil cult on this island. Maybe something evil is happening. That's my, that's my suspicions. <laughs> I mean, I gave it the Joker poster, so I don't know what the hell this thing's thinking. All right, I'm gonna let you guys go this time i put in a i put in a poster and now you guys are gonna guess what it is so a group of friends travel to the remote island did, what the, this is just the same as last one all right uh where they encounter a group of strange creatures they soon realize that they are not alone yes that's the order of that and they may be the only ones who can stop them they must find a way to stop the creatures before they destroy everything in their path the so just try and guess what this film is based on the poster that i gave it you know what it is? It's Morbin time. <laughs> Video to subs. 
<laughs> I've been trying to do that for four years now. Uh, yeah. Oh, runtime error. Guess I'm not getting any subs today. Speech brain. Speech jet separ sep I need a speech separator. Let's do this. Art classifier. Sure, why not? I upload a painting and it'll predict or try to guess who painted it. Okay, okay. I think I can work with this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yep. This picture was definitely made by Claude Monet. <laughs> All right, generate story with GPT-2. This is gonna be the last one because it's it's 2 a.m. right now, so we're gonna we're gonna get this on the road, okay? So I'm gonna type a story that's been told throughout the ages. Everyone knows this story very much deep in their hearts. Everyone knows this story. Come on, let's. Let's type it. All right, let's see what it makes with that. Club Penguin is kill. There are three young men. The first one wants to take revenge on his mother for abandoning him. The second wants to go out into the world without his mother and live a normal life. And the third wants to kill. All right, one more story. All right, D suddenly looked into the sky and saw that a pilot had written him a message. Let's see how this turns out. It was an error. Could not have said it better myself. D suddenly looks at this guy and saw the pilot had written him a message. A man approached and asked the man for forgiveness. If he, what? If he ever wanted to ask him for forgiveness, he replied, one, one, you'll die. I mean, that's pretty good. <laughs> all right, I think we had enough brain damage for today. So I want to thank you all for putting up with my bull crap for however long this video is going to be. Probably 50 minutes if, I, if I'm lazy like that. <laughs> so I want to say thank you for watching. Have a good day, everyone. And remember, death is upon us. Have a good day. Also, one more thing to note, every single piece of music in this video, including the one you're listening to right now, was made by an AI. If you listen closely, you can hear job listings being taken down as we speak. <laughs> Alright, see you later.